Welcome everyone, this is Master's Joke. Also Master's Joke 75 on Instagram. So something different today. I'm going to uh, the British Motor Show 2024, Farnborough. I've heard loads of good things about this uh, event, but I've, ne I've never been. But since I went to um, Abu Dhabi, and I went to Ferrari World, I, I now know that my son is massively into supercars so it all, it all started with the old Teslas he really got into Teslas now he's not so keen on them uh, but yeah he's into um, big time into Ferraris he wants a Ferrari or possibly a Porsche 911 so this was this was heaven for him and, and one of the nice things is when your son gets you into something uh, that he's into so I've, I've got to be honest I didn't really enjoy Ferrari world that much because I've never really been into Ferraris but since my son's got into them and we've been we, we've been like building the Lego models together uh, if you watched any of my Florida videos I, I even bought a Ferrari Puma pair of trainers baseball cap and a t-shirt so yeah I, I, I really I love doing things with my son you know together and and, and i you know i really enjoyed it so when um when my wife said you know we're going to farm because this was a literally a last minute thing look at this this is this is the ferrari um 812 i absolutely love it this this would be the uh, ferrari that i would buy um look don't get me wrong I, there's only a handful of ferraris that i can name whereas my son knows all of them the mclarens the Lamborghinis, the Porsches. He knows so much about cars. Honestly, I'm really impressed. I'm a very proud father. But yeah, when I found out, because literally my wife booked it um, literally a few days ago um, on Groupon. So we, I think it was, I think it worked out. I think, I think there was a deal on there. I can't remember. It was either 30 pounds or 40 pounds, two adults and two kids. So all my, all my, one of the reasons why my son is so bored, all his, all his best friends are currently on holiday. They've all got abroad. So um, yeah, so we, so we booked this. Definitely check out Groupon. And um, yeah, absolutely wonderful. I, I, enjoy, I enjoyed every minute of it. The, the cars were just, oh, just unbelievable. And um, one, one of the, one of the things that I want to see now is the um, Tesla Cybertruck. So, look, I know it's, <laughs> I know it's, it's, it's awful, it's ugly, it's bulletproof, but I just, I, I just love the shape of them. I, I think they look great. It reminds me of the DeLorean with the kind of um, stainless steel kind of uh, body. But I, I really, really like them. And uh, I did see one when I was in um, Florida, because I was, I was in Orlando, like April. I did see, um, I think it was the same one. I saw a Cybertruck twice, but I was only, I was driving past it, so I never got a chance to get out the car and have a look at it. But it was, you know, it did look really good. Everyone knows this car. It's the Martini Porsche 918 Spider. And again, this is one of my favorite cars. I just love it. I'd, I'd love to own one of these uh, um, bad boys. I mean, it'd just be, it'd be a dream come true. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'd never get rid of my PT Cruiser. My PT Cruiser um, does need, it's, it's in its 20th year, does need a little bit of um, cosmetic assistance. Um, and I still haven't done that uh, rust under the seals yet. Um, I think that will possibly be a job for uh, the bank holiday weekend. Shouldn't take me too long, but um, that. Nah, it will never replace my PT Cruiser. I will never get rid of it, but I do like these supercars. And yeah, as I said, it's only since my son has really got into um, um, Porsches and Ferraris, ever since we went to um, Abu Dhabi, that, that I've kind of um, got interested in them as well. Talking of Abu Dhabi, we're talking about holidays for, uh, for kind of uh, next year. You know, we went to Orlando last year, went to Disney World. I'd love to go back, but I think it's too soon. Look, I know this is a toy channel, 
So I thought I'd at least show one toy, fake Lego. Um, <laughs> let your eyes be your guide. There were a few, uh, they were a few toy stalls. I was hoping there might be, yeah, a bit like the Infill pageant, might be a few little cheeky boxes under the table with Star Wars figures. Didn't see anything, Lo but loads of, um, loads of Hot Wheels. And, um, and I was looking for a Hot Wheels um, Porsche 911 for my son, but they only had it in yellow and I wanted to get a red one. And that was like 10 pounds. But yeah, talking of holidays, I'd like to, you know, I think it's too soon to go back to Orlando and it's also so busy and so expensive. So I, I suggested as my choice that I'd like to go back to Dubai, back to the Laputa Hotel um, where Legoland is and the um, Motion Gate where the incident happened, as well as the new um, Real Madrid world. So I fancy going there because I've got a lot of unfinished business after being repatriated back to the UK. But my son's a bit uncomfortable about going back to Dubai for obvious reasons, you know, he's a bit anxious. So um, he wants to go back to Abu Dhabi to, you know, basically he wants to go back to Warner Brothers World and um, Sea World and also Ferrari World. And also that, um, I can't remember what it was called, the, uh, the water park. I can't remember what the water park was called. Yeah, was it Yaz? But it's all, it's all on Yaz Island. I think it's all Yaz Water Park, I think. But um, yeah, so uh, yeah, going back to Abu Dhabi. Might be nice, but obviously it's the big birthday coming up next year as well. So I need to kind of take all of that into account. I just can't get over how beautiful all these cars are and I, there was just too much there was too much to um to kind of film there's loads of stuff that i filmed that i couldn't um i couldn't put in the video i had to really edit it down but this is what i was uh this is what i was here for the cyber truck and it, it look i know i know people say it's ugly and and i suppose in some ways it is but this is this is one of the uh the main events for me. This is what I wanted to see. Everyone, everyone was around it. It was very difficult to uh, to kind of film. Everyone was literally wanting to get their photo taken with it. But I, I just think, you know, it's. I just think it's a just a wonderful, it's just a wonderful design. And I love the fact um, th the marketing is that um, it doesn't need any paint. It doesn't get any stone chips. It doesn't get any scratches on it. It's bulletproof. So uh, yeah, my son would love me to get a cyber truck. But I got, I mean, I love it, but I've got to be honest, I will never ever buy a, um, an electric vehicle. I'll never buy one because I just think, I just think it's a load of rubbish really. It's, I just don't think that the UK is ready for electric cars. I mean, we saw it happen last summer when <laughs> there was massive queues, people trying to get away for their summer holidays. And there, there wasn't enough, um, there wasn't enough, um, not pumps, but you know, electric facilities for people to charge up their cars on, on the journey. So yeah, the, I don't think the world's ready for electric vehicles. I think it's all a load of rubbish and um, you know, it's, it's, I'll stick to the PT Cruiser, but I do like it. I think it's proper Terminator, proper sci-fi. But then, you know, I, I, the Tesla, the Teslas, I, I, I like them, but they're, they're everywhere now. My wife, she only signs up for a, a Tesla Model 3 test drive. So, <laughs> unbelievable. So, <laughs> I couldn't believe it. I turned my back. Me and my son, we're looking at the uh, Cybertruck. Next thing I know, we're, uh, we're going on a test drive. I, I think she thinks she's like Jeremy Clarkson or something on, a, on Top Gear. I know you just said that. I know. Oh, look at the lights on the, uh, on the door. Oh, this is sick. 
Right. Where am I going? Right. Where am I going? Can you put your foot on the brake? Yeah. Wake the car up. Yeah. Why is that? That's cool. This is cool. Then what are you gonna do? Yeah. It, put it into drive. You swipe up on the right hand side there to go forward. Yeah. Swipe down. Put it into reverse. And then when you come back, if you just open the door or just tap park, that puts your handbrake on. Whoa. Is that your indicators are on the here left and right? Okay, so we're completely stalked this now. I'm gonna put right. you on a route. Yeah, and then let's go. Okay. Is this taking me out on the an actual road? Yeah, stop it. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna go out on the road. Whoa, oh, whoa. it's weird, man, because I'm so close to the ground. I like it actually, it's cool. What, what make is this car? Tesla. This is a, a oh, no, this I mean, is one of their fastest. It's a Series 3. Yeah, Model 3. Whoa, stop, stop, whoa! <laughs> if you take your foot off the accelerator, it breaks for you. I didn't realise that the um the, the back window is oh, massive. Stop, stop. <laughs> <laughs> it's not my car though. It don't it do what, John? The back window is just... There is the ceiling, there. like it's amazing, isn't it? I love it. Oh. Let's get one. I know this isn't very big, but but this is sick. This is awesome. So it's, it's, it's a, a, this person's going two miles an hour. So it's a Tesla three model yeah. wheel drive, yeah. Mod, what's it? Rear wheel drive model three. Okay, yeah, something like that. Oh, how do I do indicator? Uh, left. Oh yeah. Oh, you're doing it. This is cool. Woohoo! <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> I want to drive one of these next. A Mustang. Oh, it's got YouTube. I can watch Mr. Beast. <gasps> really? Can you? <gasps> let's see. Let's see how many new subscribers I'll get. Look, Five Nights at Freddy's Four in Roblox. <gasps> That's so cool. Let's, uh... No, don't touch it because it will go on the history. People will no, see that's it. That's all right. I'll put something else on. People might start viewing it. Look. I'm so, so sorry, we took the wrong turn in. My budget was like 30 grand, I still let me drive it. Oh, I think it is around 30 grand. Hey, look, I'm subscribing to Master's Joke. Oh, what on that thing? I've just said, oh no, I've got to sign in, I've got to oh. sign in. No, no, don't, don't, don't. Oh, who cares? Oh, oh look, they've stopped to have a little look, see what's going on. Oh my god, I love it. Let's, should we just say I'll leave the, leave the sportage in, just like did? Here's my latest video on YouTube. I'm watching like YouTube. To trade it in. Like, we buy any cars, don't we? Like, Even the seats are comfy, aren't they? I yeah, don't like that I can't do the... Can you hear my video? Yeah. <laughs> that is mad. I know this but is that, oh, I, want, I want a car that has YouTube oh, in the stop, back. Stop, stop. It's going to crash because it's got a detector on it. That's so cool. I can't believe it. It's pretty wicked. What's this here? This tells you here about how much it is. What is it? So it's done. Um, it doesn't say. It doesn't say. Uh, See, it stopped. Look, it stopped for me. It said, San, there's a roundabout, mate. You've got to slow down. It's dirty. Sort your life out. It's alright. So that's a, a, a number two. 39. Model two. What? Three. Model two. Tesla Model 3, rear wheel drive. I've got to say I was impressed. And I did enjoy watching my YouTube channel in the back seat. I thought it was great. I popped into uh, into the place to get like uh, something to eat, just a snack. Um, decided on, on a sausage sandwich. I think it was £6.99 or £6.50. Um, and that, that, what, uh, that included a cup of tea. It were, it were, it, you get two sausages. It wasn't, it wasn't great. The sausages were a bit anemic. Not highly recommended. I've, I've only seen this on telly. I've heard a lot about it. Um, the the um, art of uh, drifting, and this was absolutely fantastic. But, but I soon realised why I was the only person stood in this location behind the barriers. And as you can see, everyone else is over the other side. I think, 
I, th- I mean, I think it's pretty obvious why I, I was standing here alone. Even my wife and son weren't stood next to me because I think it's because it is just so bloody dangerous. But this was wonderful. Honestly, a wonderful uh, day out, um, highly recommended, and definitely you need to check out Groupon for the deals uh, because it's not it's it's not it's not cheap to go with, but it's not you know it's not over the top expensive, and they had so much other stuff to see. So they had all the because uh, I you know I you know if you follow my channel I I always go to the uh, infield pageant, um, an event that's very close to my heart. Um, and they had loads of classic cars here. It, 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 I mean, it, I, I didn't, uh, I didn't know that they had um, that the actual motor show was at the same place as the actual um, air show at Farnborough. But this, this uh, actual location for a, for a car show is, I, th- I, I think, I think it's brilliant. And they had uh, classic motorbikes as well. They had a lovely display of the. Um, from the AA of all the different AA trucks throughout the years uh, and because my wife did her test drive in the older uh, Tesla Model 3 I thought well I thought I'd have a go at the because I went to the Ford place and I thought I'd have a go at the old Ford M- Mustang um, so I, I queued up it wasn't a massive queue I, I queued up and I signed up to uh, drive the um, the Ford Mustang even though in my opinion it's not a real Ford Mustang because you can't have an electric Ford Mustang. You just can't do it. But I thought, you know, while I'm here, if she's done it, I'll do it. But I didn't realise you could test drive vehicles. But when, once I'd signed up and they got your email address and all your details and your budget, um, they said that someone would be going out with me on the drive. So I'd pla- I thought it was just going to be me, my wife and um, my son, just like in the Tesla. But no, you had to bring someone out with you. And I thought, oh, I, you know, I couldn't be bothered. I didn't think it'd be enjoyable if you've got someone actually sat in the back of the car with you. So, yeah, I, I signed up. I just didn't. I, I just didn't bother going back. Uh, and these these were beautiful as well in the main arena. The old uh, Lambrettas um, from the mods era. Uh, they there was something for um, everyone at the event. And I'll, I've got to say, I'm, I'll definitely be back next year. But I think because it's on, it's on for three days. I mean, there was so much. I mean, I mean the stuff. Obviously, I filmed stuff um, that I don't always show. But my son was learning how to spray body panels. But to, for me, this was the this was the car of the show. This is the car that I, I kind of fell in love with. It's an electric, but it's the old. It's called the R5. It's the Renault 5. And what I like about it is it looks like the old retro Renault 5 from the 80s. Now, I, 
this car means it means a lot to me because I used to have the uh, the Corgi, you know, the racing Renault Five. It was a little yellow one, and it came with a little, a, a, a kind of a, a little version of it. And I loved that car. I played with it to death. I'd love to get another one, um, but yeah, I, I fell in love with that. That, that if I'm going to get an electric car, that is the one that I would pick up um, because it's. Um, I mean, the Mustang. It look. It does look a little bit like a Mustang because of the the back. Yeah, you know, the rear lights. You know, the three lights on each side. Um, they also had the Ford Capri, um, and I mean, I, f I filmed all this, but I didn't add it in the video. The Ford Capri doesn't look anything like a Capri. I think it's a, I think it's a joke. I think it's a bit of a, a bit of a gimmick, really, because some people will, will want to buy it. But what is, what is the point? It's not a Ford Capri. It doesn't even look like one. But anyway, that is the end of the video. Something different. I hope you enjoyed it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. It lets me know you care. It also helps the channel. I'm going to see if there's any other car shows on um, during the bank holiday weekend. Um, so yeah, I might, you know, I might, I might pop along because I really enjoyed this. But yeah, that's the end of the video, and I'll see you in the next one. Yeah, you can. Well, yeah, I think, I don't know, I think only if it's open. It's the wrong way. Oh, no, it isn't. That's so cool. It's got some great stuff in there. Yes, No, I think, I think we should test drive this. Why not? I do look, but it, but it's not really a Mustang, is it? It's electric.